seminiferous tubule. This is the sagittal section of the testis. This outer layer is known as the tunica alvocinia. These are the septa. This septa divides the testis into different testicular lobules. Each testicular lobule contains 1 to 4 seminiferous tubules. When we touch the testis in histological section, we see several circular area and each circular area is each seminiferous tubule. So now first we discuss the single seminiferous tubule. These are the diagrammatic picture of single seminiferous tubule. This is basement membrane. On the basement membrane, sartuli cell are placed on basement membrane. This is the nucleus of the sartuli cell. Light stain nuclei with prominent nucleolus and shape of the nucleus is oval or triangular and its hole the spermatogenic cell. The spermatogenic cell is the most numerous cell of the seminiferous tubule. Outside the seminiferous uh, tubule there is a connective tissue layer, smooth connective tissue layer and outside the this connective tissue layer another cell is present this is the lytic cell which secrete testosterone and this testosterone acts on sartuli cell and influence the function of the sartuli cell this testosterone also influence the development of spermatogenic cell So this is the cross sections uh, part of the seminiferous tubule. This is one seminiferous tubule. This is another seminiferous tubule. And this uh, layer, this pink layer is the tunica propria or connective tissue layer which present outside the seminiferous tubule. This tunica propria contain a cell, myot cell and this is the sartuli cell. Sartuli cell present whole thickness of the seminiferous tubule. You see the sartuli cell contained light stain nuclei with prominent nucleolus and shape of the nucleus is oval. This is another sartuli cell nucleus. This is another sartuli cell nucleus. It's contain very big nucleus with prominent nucleolus. So this is the location of another sartuli cell. This is the location of another sartuli cell. And sartuli cell like mother hold the seminiferous, uh, sorry, um, spermatogenic cell. So these all are the spermatogenic cell. And this is sartuli cell. This is another sartuli cell. And these all are spermatogenic cell. Uh, this is the outermost layer of the seminiferous tubule. This is known as the tunica propria. It's contained myer cell already discussed. So these myer cell are the smooth muscle cell like cell which contain actin filament. So it able to contract and it's helped the movement of the spermatozoa through the lumen of the seminiferous tubule. This myot cell also contained large amount of rough endoplasmic reticulum which able to produce collagen fiber. This tunica propria layer is lack of fibroblasts. So this myot cell produce collagen fiber. And here you see the other um, cells of the seminiferous tubule. Uh, these all are the spermatogenic cell. You see this is primary spermatocyte. It is the biggest spermatogenic cell. But biggest cell of the seminiferous tubule is the sartuli cell. This is the nucleus of the sartuli cell. And this is the whole sartuli cell. 
So sertoli cell is the biggest cell of the seminiferous tubule, but primary spermatocyte is the biggest cell of the spermatogenic cell. And you see the outside the sem uh, seminiferous tubule, this is interstitial cells of lytic. It secret testosterone which acts on sertoli cell and also the development of spermatogenic cell. So tunica propria, this is tunica propria, this tunica propria separate the seminiferous uh, cells of the seminiferous tubule and sart uh, sartoli cell and spermatogenic cell from the blood vessel. In a normal aging process, the thickness of the tunica propria is increased and which decrease the productions of the spermatogenic cell and also reduce the size of seminiferous tubule. Excessive thickening of the tunica propria in early life is cause uh, infertility. So this is all about seminiferous table. If you like this video, please press the like button.